Hello and welcome back to Salty Tango's Kitchen. So, today we're going to be preparing a potato salad. And this time I'm going to click the order button. There we go. So, this is going to take a little bit of finagling, you know. I, I'm not very good at cooking. I don't know if you guys have seen my previous videos, but I'm not very good at all. But, we're going to make a pot, put some water, salt, potatoes. We're going to boil it. And then I guess we're just going to put add more things onto there like some onions and potatoes. Sweet. After that, we're going to put some chicken broth, some vinegar, some salt, pepper, white pepper, sugar, mustard, and onion for a little bit of the taste. Boil it for a little longer and then transfer into a casserole. I don't quite know what that means, but I guess we're going to figure it out together, huh? Whatever that is. And then we're going to do some chives. Okay. Boil, potato, onion, drizzle on the sunflower oil and then serve warm. So at least we can have it with us. I'm going to take this guy with us. We might need it as we travel around into this. Okay. Let's turn this on. Boop. Turn this guy on. Boop. Let's see, let's see. What do we need? What do we need? I'm gonna set that here actually. Get a little overzealous sometimes. Okay, so currently, right now, we need a potato. And if I remember correctly, this is potato? Yeah, so we need two of these. And then salt and water. So let's set this guy here. Let's turn this on. Boop. Okay. Now where could the pot is that a pot? I think this could be the pot. Let's see. Ooh. Let's reach down there. Let's turn this. Turn it on. Oh, that's the back one. Oh. Nope. Oh. Don't do this in real life, but you can tell if it's hot if you put your hand over it. Yep, it is pretty hot. Cool. So now it's actually I forgot. Let's see. One thousand milliliters of water or for people watching from Europe one liter if you're asking me what's that in normal I don't know well oh one liter cool 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 so 1.1 you know put that there and by normal I mean I guess the American Imperial system that's like 40 quarts or something I don't actually know don't trust me I really don't know let's see a little bit of salt and potatoes so let's go over here to our handy dandy salt area I believe this is the salt yep and we're gonna need about one two three four I'm not gonna count all the way up but you know what I mean get up to 20 there we go set that there now we're gonna add our two potatoes or 300 milligrams of potatoes it doesn't say cut it so let's just throw it in there Cool. Make sure it's all well mixed. Oh, let's add some more water for effect. <laughs> uh. Cool. Oops, I might have screwed it up. But oh well, this is a learning experience, right? <laughs> let's put that there. Let's boil that. For 120 seconds. Boop, 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 boop. Let that do its thing. Then we're going to grab some onions and potatoes. Two potatoes. Two potatoes, a couple onions. Let's see. Let's probably put it in a bowl. Potatoes and some onions. Are these onions? Onions. Uh, okay. So 120. Okay. To go right here let's put this over in our cutting board hopefully it doesn't like to get itself okay so 15 bits huh one two let's see how much of this uh, oh don't mind me i'm just not very good at this okay boom and then they cut it? I guess it did. See, the good thing about this game is 
it's kind of unrealistic because you can kind of cut your hand without cutting your hand. So, as you just saw me, uh, let's see. Oh, well, I guess not. It doesn't want me to cut it. That's cool. Well, how many is that? 40. That's good enough for me. And it's going to be one, two, three, four. Or not. That's cool. Well, it looks like this is going to be the routine. Okay, I guess that's the way it is. This is going to be uh, 115 pieces. Should be a lot easier to cut than the potatoes. How much is that? Let's see. Let's do a little measurement. Oh, 18. That's actually okay. That that don't pay attention to this one. This is a little bit bigger than it's supposed to. But hey, who's counting, right? I'm the master chef here. So what I put in goes. At least as far as I know. Okay, here we go. This we're good. Put that down. Grab this guy. Move it over here. Still hot. Boop. To grab all our fixings and put it all because I can't really do that. There you go. There you go. There you go. All in there. Yep, 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 yep. Stubborn pieces. Cool. This. I'm going to do this. Oh, tasting. There you go. There you go. I hit myself on that one. It's soup. Good soup. Okay. Grab this guy. Put it back on the pots. What else do we need? Add to pot, chicken broth. This might overflow. Let's see if there's a bigger pot actually. Well, that's kind of cooling down after being tasted. Oh, did I not grab that? Cool. Well, looks to me like we're gonna have to finagle with some small pots. I don't have any big pots around here, so no problemo. So I'm gonna check, all empty. Well, as they say, let's see what happens. Uh, let me just dump a little. Let me dump half of it off. Am I right? You know, because I think I put two liters in there. Uh, there you go. That's about right. As a master chef myself, you know, it's exactly the way it should be. So let's get some chicken broth, some white vinegar. Do we have any of that here? It's a very good question. I know we need this one eventually. Uh, vinegar, vinegar. What is this guy? Rice wine? Sesame oil? I don't think this is what I'm going to use it. Just in case. Nope. I know you need you eventually. Let's put this here. So, let us see. Some liquids. And I forgot it is some chicken broth. Chicken broth. There we go. And then we're going to need some white vinegar. Let's do some. Okay, there it is. Great thing about white vinegar is that it can go with just about anything. The flavor surpasses the taste. Pretty much is the same thing, but you know, who's counting? Am I right? Put that there. Throw that there. Chicken broth, 500 milliliters. little more it's gonna be a little nice little taste of that over there oh there we go cool 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 so that goes away white vinegar 20 throw that there we go works for me now we need some white pepper and sugar and mustard of course because every good soup deserves some mustard at least that's what they say in Germany at least I think so. Because this is actually a German potato salad. As a man who's never been to Germany myself, I can say... I don't actually know if that's true or not. Is this, oh! The squeeze. <laughs> it's a little bit more than 10, but you know. It's pretty good. Let's see, is this sugar? Just let me make sure. Because you know me, I'm not very accurate about things. Let's see. 10 grams. I am accurate about my spices. Because they are the spice of life. And then just says onion. So, is that a whole onion? I guess we'll find out. Let's grab a whole onion here. One whole onion in the soup. For some reason, I have to dictate again. Let's see. I'm going to do... Oh. 60. There we go. 
And while that's cooking, we're gonna transfer into a casserole. I don't quite know what that means, but I guess we'll figure it out as we go. So this bowl is round, so therefore we're probably gonna need the round bowl. There, cool. This is our round bowl that we're gonna garnish with shives and drizzle with sesame seed oil. This is our casserole. I think I think we have to mix it or something. I don't actually know. So what was it? Shives, right? Well, make sure this my thing works. Shives, shives, shives. Eight milligrams of shives. This one. Of course it's this one. Nope. Um, I wish I knew what any of this stuff means. You know, to play oh there you go, cool. We've been playing this for quite some time. By that I mean not very long at all. I still don't know what any of that nope. There. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Boom. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Throw that there. Cool. That showed off. Good. And then we're going to use our handy dandy casserole maker. Okay. Is this soup? Let's see. Let's try it out. Mmm. Soup. Okay. Um. <laughs> well, I hope they are satisfied with our lovely mixture of uh, stuff there how do I do this let's see is there a ladle there is a ladle let's see red or blue actually not red I'm gonna sniff them there why is that black I don't know what is this deep what I'm just gonna throw that in there I don't know what deep means but we're just gonna I'm just gonna fill it. there we go boop, 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 boop. Okay, uh, well, this looks appetizing, am I right? Okay, I'd eat this at a restaurant. <laughs> Drizzle with some, okay. <laughs> that works. Uh, serve warm and some, of course, some garnish. Let's just garnish some chives on this lovely dish. I'm going to move it over there carefully because I don't want them to think that I don't care about their taste buds, am I right? Put that there, and let's go ahead and serve it up. And there we go, 100% olive oil, sunflower oil. Yes, no. <laughs> well, cooking points 12, hey, that's, that's good. I got 12 points, right? I don't even know what casserole meant, and that's pretty good. Let's see what the guest complaints are, okay. Oh, not enough. Wait, what? It's not up there. I think it was like, I put 20? I need a 10? I don't know. Not enough sugar? What? Oh, I actually, I forgot this one. About it. That's, that's on me. As a master chef, I sometimes forget stuff. You know what I mean? So, white pepper's pretty good. Let's see. Potato salad, onion. Overcooked. Bad cutting technique. Wrong amount of product. Overcooked. And, okay, same thing. You know what? But the temperature was perfect. That's what counts. Sometimes you gotta take a few L's and take the W's when you can. So that's pretty good. Okay. Well, let's see what we have here. And that pretty much concludes today's lovely video. Let's go back here. Let's just see what they have. This is all the recipes I can uh, play with and make for you guys. So, oh, hamburger. Oh, honey mustard. Yum. So, if you guys have any suggestions about any of this, and it's going to slowly scroll through these, just tell me, and I can see about making them. Will they be accurate? Well, I don't actually know. This is kind of one of those, uh, we'll figure it out as we go, you know? Fast ratatouille. Crazy. Pink soup. A Ukrainian borscht. Man, it's pretty cool with egg. Yeah, there's a lot of recipes here, so just write down in the comments what you want me to make next, and I can, uh maybe finagle something for you the viewer otherwise have a beautiful day and enjoy this amazing uh new york san francisco this amazing landscape we have in front of us